See, this, this I will not be missing. So I'm also going to be extremely late for work. Um, if anyone from work watches these vlogs, now uh, you, uh, you know why. After work I'm going to run home and get something to eat and then I'm going to go down to the local camera store and possibly pick up a mic. So that'll help production a lot better and I can finally use my T3i for these vlogs which will be better. really cold out. Alright, so it's about a quarter to two. Um, there's people coming to the house at quarter to five to look at it. So I'm gonna run home, grab something to eat real quick, and then I'm gonna go look at Mike's. And I decided to warm up the nachos from last night. All I had to do was get it from here to here, and the paper ripped, and they went there. over there. I'm not gonna risk it. Hey man, how's it going? Alright, well thanks. Well, if I can't find anything else, probably pop back in. Yeah, sure. Alright, so they didn't have any external mics at all, actually. So I'm going to head over and check Long and McQuaid, and hopefully I should be able to find something by the end of the day. If not, I might have to order it. You will arrive at your destination on the left in 300 meters. So it was kind of spontaneous, it's not the road, it's not exactly what I wanted, but for now it was the cheaper option, so that's probably my best bet. So we're going to go ahead and open this up. I've got my T3i set up there. But we'll... Okay, so I will switch over to the T3i now. And this is the audio that it is getting. As you may tell, there's a lot of noise in the background. There's a lot of frequency. So let's switch it over to the Apex 577. So there's a light right here. And it turns on for a second. And then it turns back off. Mm, don't think that's good. Does this sound any better? I really hope it sounds better. 
All right, so never buy the Apex 577. One of the big red flags that I should have figured out at first is that there's no reviews of this microphone online. So I just wasted $200.